I'd like to issue a little warning about people that say the phrase, Jesus is Lord. You see, that phrase appears nowhere in the King James Bible. Let me show you what does appear. 1 Corinthians chapter 12, verse 1. Now concerning spiritual gifts, brethren, I would not have you ignorant. Ye know that ye were Gentiles carried away unto these dumb idols, even as ye were led. Wherefore I give you to understand that no man speaking by the Spirit of God calleth Jesus accursed, and that no man can say that Jesus is the Lord, but by the Holy Ghost. See, the charismaniacs come out and they say, Oh, oh, you know, saying Jesus is the Lord is proof of, of the Holy Ghost indwelling you. So we'll just come out and say, Jesus is Lord, Jesus is Lord, Jesus is Lord. Uh, that's not what the scripture says. It's definitive article before singular reference. The Lord, only one. Lines up with all the other scriptures in the Bible. There's only one Lord. Jesus is also called King of Kings and Lord of Lords lowercase lords. He is the Lord all throughout Scripture. There's only one Lord, you see. That's why it's important to say Jesus is the Lord. So you see people and they come out and they say, oh look, we have t-shirts that say Jesus is Lord. We have slogans that say Jesus is Lord. We have the pulpit that says Jesus is Lord down here. Oh, aren't we going to just find Christians? No, actually you're Bible perverters, you're Bible corruptors. Jesus is the Lord. That's very important, extremely important. But I want to show you something else interesting here in this passage, another defense of the Godhead being one God, not three that all claim the title of one. Okay? <laughs> the Trinity is false. Let me show you. Verse 4. Now, there are diversity of, diversities of gifts, but the same Spirit only one, the same Spirit. And there are diver differences of administrations, but the same Lord. Only one Lord. And there are diversities of operations, but it is the same God which worketh all in all. The same God. There's only one God. What do we see there? The same Spirit, the same Lord, the same God. They're the same. Body. Soul, spirit, one being. You understand? They're all the same. Jesus doesn't have his own soul and spirit and body. The Father, God the Father doesn't have his own soul and spirit and body of flesh. And the Holy Spirit doesn't have his own soul, spirit, flesh. All right? They're three parts of one being. Just plain and simple. But getting back to the original intent of this video, Watch out for ministries or people or whatever else that come out and say Jesus is Lord. They take out the definitive article, the Lord. That's so important to understand.